some reason I'm feeling this double barreled popper. Pretty sick looking. I got that at Schultz Outfitters. You can see their logo right here on the front of this box. That is my popper box. And then I've got a few streamers on this side. Let's trim that tag end. And it is time to rock. Always test your knot. That is a lesson that's never fun to learn the hard way. When you break off a fly, like the first time a fish bites it, eh, it makes me pretty freaking mad. I'm gonna lose the popper on the first damn bite. What the shit, man? Dude, I tested that knot. Come on, fudge. Come on, man. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, he's not happy. That thing's stuck in his face and now he's trying to get it out. Sorry, man. There's a fish, finally. Feels like a decent one. Well, I'll take freaking anything today. Today's been pretty crappy. Ah, smallmouth bass. On the top water. Sometimes it's a while in the making. Just takes a bit of patience. I hope I don't <laughs> lose this guy. I just don't feel like grabbing my net right now, so I'm just going to lip him real quick here. Well, alright, I'm just grabbing him. There we go. Oh, so, here is the infamous boogle bug that I like so much for a topwater lure. Says it right across the top there. Boogle bug. Kind of an iridescent green with chartreuse limbs flailing about. Real nice paint job. I really like that. And here is a smiley. Beautiful coloration. Let me turn this way so I can get the sunlight on. A beautiful, healthy looking fish. Just love it. I'd like to catch one about twice his size, three times his size. Finally. You know, sometimes you hear really conflicting information and sometimes real life just plays out way differently. I've heard when it rains and the water flow volume goes up, the fish tend to push. Well, in my experience, here's another one. Nice acrobatics. Oh my gosh. I hope this camera's on right now. Okay, he's in some weeds. This one I think I'll net. Because he's a little feisty. Here we go. Come on, buddy. Oh, Shiza. Oh, he's making a run for it. I cannot believe he actually stayed on. He stayed pinned. That honestly was miraculous. There's no way he should have stayed pinned. That was all over the place. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ooh, he, he was pinned good. And his jaw feels like it's broken. I'm not sure how he broke his jaw. Ooh, he. He's gotten into some stuff. This fella's had a rough life, man. Wow. 
Here you go. Look at that jaw. That is messed up looking. Look at that. What happened to him? That looks nasty. But other than that, he looks okay. Some nice looking fish. He's got a nasty little tumor on his butt there. Still, it's about twice as big as the last one, so I guess I got my wish, didn't I? Thank you, Lord. Thank you, sweet baby Jesus. And he put on an awfully nice show for us. That was uh, very nice of him. We do appreciate that. We appreciate the show, brother. So nice. All right, let's get back in there. See what else we can pull out of there. Oh man, I love it. When the booga bug bite is on. The booga bug bite is on. And my cast is on. Okay, there we go. That's a little better. Oh, it's got a little hit there. Another one. Right. Really trying to cast it right over this lay down. Oh, that's what I wanted. There's a submerged log right there. Oh, that was a bite. The Andy's on. Got him. Oh, that's a nice looking one. He's trying to break me off in some weeds. He's not fighting that good though. What the heck is this guy's deal? Come on, you're a smallmouth bass. Put your ass into it, brother. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. All right. This fight's ending early. Oh, there we go. All right, I got it. Thank you again, Booglebug. Look at that, it's a largie. A Huron River largie. Very nice. Kind of light in color. Thanks for playing, buddy. Of course, my batteries ran out. Had to switch batteries. And then, <laughs> before turning my camera back on, I hooked into another nice Smalley who's been putting on a nice show for me. But he's still on. It took me a minute to get the camera rolling. Oh, yes. Huge, but hey, he counts. And he was fun. You can always count on these smallies to show up. You know what I'm saying? They always show up for a fight. Love it. Look at that beautiful, beautiful iridescence. I just love that. Absolutely beautiful. There he goes. strike. Oh, that was fantastic. Oh, this is a good fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Nice little tug there. Nice pull. I don't want to play him too aggressively, but he's a nice one. He's coming up this current right here. He's actually hanging out in that trough right now. I think I'm going to want to net this one. we got a beautiful, beautiful one right here. Come on. I really want to land this one. Come on. Come on, buddy. He's not going anywhere. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's fighting. He's putting up a good fight. Fly line is right in the way. I'm trying to bring him up into the current and then down to me. You know what, after this fish, I'm going to retie, whether or not I think I need to. I'm doing it. Alright. He's up in the current, coming down to me, and oh, I missed, son of a gun. There he is. Got him. Oh, that's the best fish of the day. This is easily the best specimen of the day. What a beautiful fish. 
Absolutely gorgeous. Probably only like a pound and a quarter, pound and a half. I don't really weigh my fish anymore unless I think they're over two and a half or three pounds. That's about right. That is a beautiful fish though. Absolutely gorgeous. Alright, let them go.